man. Thank you, Jesus, for everything you've done in my life. Thank you, Jesus, for blessing me with that HD. Called a Harley Davidson in 2017. 758 Harley Davidson, man, thank you Jesus for prospering me, you see my heart and my intentions, you always dealing with me and correcting me, man, thank you Jesus for everything you're doing in my life, and thank you Father God for teaching me to have compassion for my, my friend, and teaching him how to conserve his money so we can build him up and prosper him yeah thank you jesus you are so wonderful to me and everyone around me thank you jesus for dying on that cross for us man thank you jesus christ you are so wonderful i'm giving you praises and being honest out of my heart thank you jesus christ for everything you're doing in my life thank you jesus you so worthy to be praised. I just want to be honest with you, Lord. Doesn't matter how I feel about you. I'm just going to speak it. So that way you can do something with it. Because you can't do anything if I'm not open-minded and honest with you. Jesus Christ just wants us to have a relationship with him. Mm -mm. You know I have a t-shirt on the wall It says Jesus is my savior Not my religion That's how it's supposed to be He's my savior He saved me He came running after me While I was on the streets Trying to act like a G Man smoking on that weed Drinking on that Hennessy Man that didn't do me nothing But brought me down hills instead of up Jesus Christ wants to build us up not tear us down everything that happened in my life it was just to draw me closer to Jesus Christ like being kidnapped held hostage and being a middleman slash a dope dealer man I'm from the south don't need no goals in my mouth he trying to take me out of my Christianity, but I'm still buck wild. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Man, that's what it be, man. Satan ain't got no authority over me or my household. Son, what's up with that? Man, Satan always trying to come into our mind, telling us that we just a bunch of low lives. Man, I got victory in the blood of Jesus Christ. Yeah. What? Now, how you know about that? You don't know nothing about that because you ain't truly serving Jesus Christ. You need to stop playing around, start serving Jesus Christ wholeheartedly, man. That's the way you be, man. Read your word because if you don't, Satan already got you trampled on his feet. What's up with that, man? For so many years, I refused to read the word with understanding and with wisdom. And now, I'm a whole lot more stronger because I'm with the right crowd. Man, thank you, Jesus, for everything you're doing in my life. I give you praises in the glory. Man, thank you, Jesus, for everything you're doing. Yeah, I may not have a whole lot, but I got more than most people overseas. And you know what? Thank you, Jesus Christ, for teaching me how to be more of a giver than a receiver see that's what's wrong with us Christians watching them TVs with a receiver they trying to teach us how to receive from the world instead of from Jesus Christ I'm not even thinking of these things God's just placing it in my heart because I'm not bright enough to think like these things and thank you Jesus I love you father I got so much joy in my life because of you. Because yeah, I know that you're true, Jesus. 
And I know that you love me back And you're showing it all the time Thank you, Jesus Christ, for dealing with my mom and my dad Man, building me a relationship with my mother and my father There was a one time when my father would come back home Turn off my Christian music from underneath the garage Now he ain't even touched that knob at all Cause I'm showing him that I'm trying to change better And trying to do my Take care of responsibilities around the house Oh, did I say something wrong? I'm talking about responsibilities Most Christians don't even know how to do that, right? Wanna play on your video games Watch TV all day Ticking off your wife Making her go crazy Your wife is looking for a real man She's not gonna be open and honest I wish they was but that ain't how women fly. They give off body language and we are supposed to supposed to know what that that is. Sometimes us as men, we dumb, man. We can't see that. And even when we do see it, sometimes we just don't wanna realize it. We don't wanna you know confront that, you know? I wanna thank you, Jesus Christ, for everything you're doing in my life, man. Thank you, Jesus Christ, for giving me knowledge and wisdom and understanding and discernment. Man, man, Lord, I bind up all this murderous and suicidal spirits around me. I bind up that voodoo spirit and that witchcraft spirit that's up in my city and in my parish and in my state. In the name of Jesus Christ, I plead the blood of Jesus Christ over these people's minds, thoughts, hearts, soul, and body today. Lord, guide our ways. Teach us how to have compassion over our friends and family and even over our enemies. I ain't riding up on my enemies. I'm blessing my enemies because the devil likes to speak nothing but curses. But as Christians, we got to start speaking blessings over our enemies because he don't like it. Man, thank you, Jesus, for everything you're doing in my life. Man, thank you, Jesus Christ, for everything you're doing in my life. Man, praise to the glory, the King of Kings. Man. All right, well, I'm going to end it right here. In the name of Jesus Christ, I speak life over y'all that y'all are blessed and highly favored. And I pray that God will guide your ways to seek. Hold on, I'm going to just show you. It's called reading your Bible. If you ain't reading it, you ain't getting strengthened up. We got to read the Word so we know what's in it. So that way when the devil comes to us, we'll be able to uh, go up against his words. We'll know what, it, what the Lord says and what it doesn't say. Have a blessed one. Adios, amigos. Bye-bye.